Hi everyone, welcome to this quick tutorial of Visual XP, XP which is a new plugin for Xplane 12. Uh, basically it creates new atmosphere and and cloud-based clouds for uh, Xplane 12. I haven't seen any videos on, on the internet yet, so I d I've decided to make one. So first of all, probably the most important thing that everybody asks if it kills your FPS or not. To be honest, since I installed this plugin, I have not seen a single drop uh, in terms of FPS. So I'm not sure if it's the same for everyone, but I'm using an R RTX uh, 2080 Ti video card and an AMD 3900 processor. It haven't killed my FPS, so I'm very pleased with this plugin. Not like uh, when I bought X and Vero in the back, that was that was horrible. So this one looks pretty cool. So first of all, let me just jump from okay the runway lights and the and the lights are a bit messed up. I think it looks way too bright for me. So this is nighttime, as you can see. Uh, Let's just skip forward to daytime. Daytime will be a, diff a bit different. So, so the sun comes up. It looks amazing, I think. And then, as long as we are here in the bright, let's just check what else we do have in this plugin. So basically, you can choose from seven different ozone colors that's the first one second third fourth fifth sixth seventh i think i really like the fourth and the seventh so probably i will i will keep number seven okay so here you got a couple settings which i'm not going to touch uh, clouds so from the clouds um, if you click on this one it makes your clouds a bit more mm, blurry I think I don't like that I, I rather prefer this fluffy nice clouds cloud shadows it does not make such a big difference uh, then you got this type of clouds two three four so then we can go on to water I'm not really sure if it's going to change the water here or not yes it does okay so probably I like the middle one the most and the scenery light modes hmm I can't see any changes but yeah whatever um, then we can go on weather here of course you can choose live weather or you can set up something yourself so let's just try this time really cloud stormy weather um, oh yeah here you can actually change some clouds I think they look pretty good to be fair I think they look amazing especially the towering I've tried it earlier today and it created some really nice towering cumulus clouds so I can't it's not so bad yeah and then you have only the cumulus but I think most of us flies in live weather condition yeah but leave it as it is now here you can save your presets and there's one that Visual XP made um, so Yeah, that's that's pretty much it. I just wanted to give you a quick look. 
let's get back into the cockpit yeah the only thing I'm not amazed with is the is the night because the night looks very dodgy to me these uh, runway lights and and yeah lights are not not the best they look great but it's not the best as I said if you apply a bit of uh, fog then it looks <laughs> ridiculous uh, so I well, they turned that off but as I said let's let it go uh, the visual XP is is I think the best but I didn't like it was on color so that's the only thing I've changed at the moment I will show you I'm using just a, an add-on scenery for Genova I still have 42 47 FPS 52 so pretty good I'm happy with this getting a bit uh, darker so sunset I think it looks amazing to be honest I have not tried on cruise level yet but I think it looks amazing and yeah, as it doesn't kill my FPS it's, it's a good plugin to go with and I hope they are going to fix these these runway lights and lights because they're a bit touchy but it looks great so let it go fantastic but yeah I'm not sure the city lights looks very strange to me it does look a bit like this when the weather is foggy I think in real life but uh, it's just a bit too much anyway they are going to fix this I'm pretty sure so let's go back and let's go back a bit in time and see what it looks like from outside now come on come on come on i'm very happy with the with the sunset it's i think it looks amazing anyways so i haven't tried flying through a cloud yet, so... So let's see that and then that's gonna be the end of this video as soon as we can fly through some clouds.
of this and enjoy the view. Uh, don't worry about the speed and whatever, it's just a test to see how it works, how this works. But as I said, I think it looks amazing. It's really worth this plugin to have. that's it about this tutorial I hope you all liked it and you can see the difference between wow this is just absolutely stunning hope you can all see the difference between the default uh, clouds and and the ones that um, this new plugin brings to the simulator um, yeah I can't wait to see how they are going to progress with the with the night light because night lights because that was something that I really loved in XM Vero. The the cloud uh, not the cloud the sky and the and the lights. Especially the night light man. The landing lights got reflected on the clouds. So I'm hoping that they are going to progress as well. But <laughs> at least not killing my FPS. So that was it. I hope you all enjoyed it and yeah. I recommend this plugin. If you don't mind, just please subscribe to my channel. You can watch hundreds. Well, I've got over or over hundred landing videos. I explained too. So if you like this type of content, just please uh, don't subscribe. Bye.